back's got to be straight. Joining the ranks of the special warfare community requires a very high level of dedication and physical fitness. Matthew Murray, chief EOD technician, and his team held a brief and conducted a physical screening test to aid any sailors in Sigonella up to the challenge. It all starts from being a really good sailor. You have to have your command behind you. You have to have people willing to support your decision to, to go forward, to move in a different direction with your career. You should be the kind of guy that people look forward to to working with and more or less be the go-to guy. The, the almost expert in your field. Those are the people we want for these special programs. We want the people who stand out and who are really motivated and good at what they do. Choosing to move into special warfare is a big decision for a sailor. And getting some face time with someone who has first-hand experience of the process and can answer any questions about the community can be very helpful. You have to sit and you have to talk to the people trying out. You know, I look at the, everyone here who was at the brief and tried the PSC today, and all I see is uh, potential. These are the people who are going to be coming into our ranks and we're going to be working next year side by side. Having that face to face is just invaluable. The PST, consisting of a 500 yard swim, push ups, sit ups, pull ups and a mile and a half run, sets the bar high when it comes to fitness. You know, if you have a man who's, who's, uh, who's got grit, who will not quit, nine times out of ten he'll make it. He'll overcome whatever physical obstacles he has and he'll make the times. From Naval Air Station Siganella, I'm Seaman Luke Askey.